Warren William here from Smarter Data with quick definitions helping you understand how to analyze the stocks, the stock markets, the language jargon, and all the ins and outs. So the term macro environment, what's that referring to? What are some of the concerns in investing under different macro environments? Let's go to the video to find and explain what the term macro environment means. And at the end of the video, there'll be three quick bullet points to take away. When reference is made to the macro environment or current macro environment, this refers to the set of conditions that could impact the general business cycle. The macroeconomic environment refers to the overall state of the economy, including the level of economic activity, the level of employment, and the level of prices or inflation, and also the level of international trade. This can also include factors such as level of government spending, the level of taxes being imposed, and the level of monetary policy being interest rates. Thus closely associated with macroeconomic data are GDP trends, inflationary pressures, consumer confidence, and employment dynamics. Thus, this indicates the likely impact on business decisions such as capital expenditures and employment. It's important to note that macroeconomics is not the same as microeconomics, which refers to specific market conditions facing an individual business or industry. In closing, three quick bullet points regarding macro environment. This describes the state of the overall economy. It includes factors such as growth, GDP, inflation, price stability, and employment levels. Thus, the leading economic indicators, which we should be looking at closely every month when they're published.